when I uh, went in and, and met with the Nuka chiropractors and saw what they were doing, that this was something that really fit for me as something that I would enjoy doing with my life and a, a way that I could help people that were suffering with uh, a real knowledge of a potential solution. It was a solution that I hadn't seen before and the effects were tremendous and I was immediately taken by it and I knew, I recognized, I knew that it was the thing that I was gonna do with my life. Uh, physiology is that the human body has a hierarchy of neurology. We all kind of know it's true. I mean, those are big fancy words, but we know it's true. If you're walking in a forest and a tree falls on your low back, you're a paraplegic. If that same tree fell on your neck, you're a quadriplegic. So by all standards and definitions, being a quadriplegic includes being a paraplegic and is worse. And so if you injure yourself in your upper neck, then if it's severe enough, then you're instantly dead. So the question is, if you've injured yourself, so it's not correct, it's not uninjured, but it's not injured so catastrophically that you're dead, then what things could it affect in your health? And the answer, I think, is everything. Um, you know, Calgary's beautiful, the mountains are close, we love hiking, um, and, uh, and water sports. So really, I, I play basketball, I played a lot of soccer in my life, um, and, uh, and, but in terms of my leisure activity, in fact, a lot of it comes back to uh, spending time, when I'm not spending time with my family, is spending time doing things relative to moving this profession forward. So I donate a lot of that time back to the profession. Uh, when you're able to uh, offer them some hope, and you're able to let them understand that the underlying condition that they're experiencing might have a reasonable explanation that nobody has really found yet. Um, that begins an exciting time. And then when, uh, after a, a short period of time, uh, they begin to notice that their body is operating differently and that it is functioning better and that they're starting to feel better and they're able to do the things that they weren't able to do before, then it gets even more exciting. And then a decade later, once uh, they're doing things that they couldn't do in the years previous to seeing you and they're still doing those things and they're enjoying their life and their body's operating the way it's supposed to operate, then there's a real deep level of satisfaction that I as a clinician feel by uh, being able to help the patient uh, have that experience in their life.